Hello everyone, I'm going to talk about my planetary 3D model. Essentially, this is um, if I were to do a full scale on 3D modeling the, um, the physics simulation with all the planets. I do have the planets lined up essentially of their planets. Um, I used to have like their moon, but it might be saved in the other file. But if I do find it, I'll just talk about about it. Um, essentially, you see the alignment um, of the planetary systems. Uh, you ha see Saturn's ring, Jupiter, Mars, and all all that stuff. Um, this is basically to show the planetary system of having it aligned. I did at one point have the um, the animation, but uh, it's probably saved in the other file. Again, if I find it, I will, because I'm pretty sure I added moons and all this stuff. But essentially, if I find it, this is basically of like if you're wanting to start up. Um, this is a, just a quick video if you want to see how you can start up. Start up. Um, if you want to know how to do Saturn's rings, essentially, let me find out, remember what they're made of. Um, easiest way for me to find out, remember how I made them. Um, you make them with ring shapes, um, and then like kind of space them out, and then you can kind of give them uh, essentially another color. I did. Yeah, I essentially named all the planets. Um, again, if I find the um, file, because I this is not the final file I have for them, but essentially this is what um, um, they will look like with their um, animation and all that stuff. Um, I'm sure I colored it because I essentially remember coloring, but this is usually how I began the project and that's all I wanted to talk to, about today essentially how you can start up the planets it's just basic spheres and then you can add a material and mesh to it if you want it to look um, the Sun essentially I prefer that you use um, um, light a animation to do it because it does better because it is a gas giant um, I mean, you can do it with Jupiter, but, like, it's really a personal preference. So, if you're watching from this point of view of this video, um, essentially, I found the video, um, I found it, it was labeled as number two, I should have looked further down um, but essentially this is after I colored it at the moons to the planets um, don't um, and it basically gave the planets the color when I started it's gonna move fast so don't blame me if you can't keep up but um, I don't know how to slow it down on Maya's. I know how to slow it down on um, Unity, but not on Maya. So if it were on Unity, I, I could slow down the animation. But essentially, that that's the planet. Ignore the moon that has abandoned whichever planet's right next by. But um, essentially, the, it's doing the orbit and then realigning, doing the orbit of the planets and then realigning. And then essentially, because the, technically the planets, well not the, um, the moons are orbiting, like, but like for some reason Maya messes up when you do at the same time, but the animation is for there. Um, but essentially, you're seeing you basically you can animate in Maya, but um, I feel like it's better if you were 
um, doing the um, planets that you do the animation in Unreal or Unity because I don't know what's with my animation. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. I'm a little bit more practiced and I will perfect or at least know how to get the animation to act correctly. So this is like based on my 3D animation. Essentially, if I wanted to continue on to my um, physics simulation of the planet orbits. Um, if you watch one of my previous videos, you can see how I um, essentially got the planets to orbit using the um, math, basically. Um, but um, essentially, if you want to start it off, um, you, um, and not rely on get like an accurate like accurate data because um, essentially um, I want to say you want to use math because it's more accurate on the alignment and all you have to do is find out the mass of the planet and the distance it's from each other and the initial initial velocity and so basically um if you want to start with that, do what you have to do.